Hey everybody, we are about to plant these different bushes and vines on a 50 foot section of our chicken run. Now the chicken run is not done, but we're planting these for a specific reason. We want to eat them, but we also want to have a way to provide some extra food for the chickens. So we're going to plant these on the outside of the chicken fence, next, right next to it, so that the vining plants can vine on the chicken fence. So. We got these from a local big box store, but one interesting thing about them is the company that they come from, which is Van Zyverden, is local to our city right next to us. Uh, they're located in Meridian, Mississippi. So we're doing what we can to, to support a local company here. And what we are planting are three varieties of blueberry, a raspberry variety, and two varieties of grapes. So we're gonna plant them in this order, the Jersey blueberry, the Thompson Seedless Grape, the Latham Red Raspberry, Climax Blueberry, the other Raspberry, the Flame Seedless Grape, and then the Tri Blue Blueberry. So we're going to prepare these the way that the packaging tells us to, and then I'll explain to you how we're going to space them out. Okay, so here's a good view at the uh, 50 foot span of this fence that we're going to do. And my intention is it will go five feet in from each corner to plant the blueberries that will be on the end. And then from those two points we'll find the middle, so 20 feet at that point between the two, and plant the other blueberry. And then to space the distance between all the blueberries, if we go about six and two thirds foot, we'll be able to plant the raspberry and the grapes and that way each plant will be evenly spaced throughout this. Okay, so that's gonna be the end of this project for now. As you can see, like I said, the uh, first plant is five foot from the edge and then from there, every six and two thirds feet going down the length of the fence. As most of you are aware that have been following the channel, we do have free range rabbits. So that's what you're noticing here with these cages. If, uh, if you did not have a concern with small animals trying to take out your plants that are developing, then you might not have to take that extra step. If it was a grape vine, we put fencing material on both sides. If it is a raspberry or blueberry, then we put fencing just around the entire plant because we feel we'll be able to take the fencing material off the plant before it gets too big and the plant would still be big enough to uh, withstand any uh, small eating off the bottom branches by the rabbits. So. We'll let you know how this progresses over time. Obviously, this is a permanent planting, so it'll be something to watch for years to come. Thank you all for watching. See you next time.